Hey everyone, it's Kara here from Boho Berry, and I'm back with one month in my digital planner, day 11. Um, I'm back with another screen recording this time, and hopefully this isn't TMI, <laughs> but um, I started a new cycle. Um, in other words, I started my period yesterday, and it's been pretty brutal. Another nice, lovely side effect of coming off of hormonal birth control. So I have been mostly working from my couch with a heating pad uh, since yesterday, and I'm otherwise feeling fine. It's just um, I don't really want to do a lot of moving <laughs> right now. Let's just put it that way. So I hope this is okay for today. I'll go back to the overhead view, hopefully tomorrow when things calm down a little bit. But I'm gonna go right into Thursday here and zoom in and go ahead and mark off some of my tasks. So I'm gonna go to my pen tool at the top. And then I'm also gonna turn on this shape tool in the top left and mark off my tasks. So I did not take out the trash yesterday again not feeling so hot. I did set up some appointments to look at office spaces and those are gonna happen next week and the following. And then I did get through my email and reply to Lisa and Bonnie as well. So I'm gonna mark that off. And then in addition to those things, I did also work on some fun new uh, layouts like planner layouts. So I'm gonna put those in here. And I also got started on working on the 2019 <laughs> Boho Berry Digital Planner. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and mark those off since that's what I worked on yesterday. And I'm gonna draw my dividing line so that I can do a little bit of journaling right down here. All right, so we got a little bit of journaling done and I do want to update my projects. I did not get around to working out yesterday for obvious reasons and I probably won't today either. So I'm really hoping that this weekend I'm feeling a little better so that I can top off this workout five times a week project. Um, I do want to fill in my planner layouts a little bit more. I'm hoping to have these released either later today or tomorrow for you all. And then pantry clean out is happening on Saturday and office hunt, I made some appointments. So I'm gonna fill that in a little bit. All right, and then planning for today. Let's get here to Friday. All right, and as far as weather goes, it's gonna be nice and sunny today. So I'm gonna find my sunshine sticker right here, copy. And let's resize that down to fit. That looks good. All right, and now I need to highlight my time bar for the day. So I'm gonna use my light blue for sleep, my yellow for morning routine, and pink for work. There we go. All right, so onto our task list for today. Uh, payroll, I can go ahead and mark that off because I already paid Kristen. And let's see, what is next? I really want to finish these planner layouts and get them in the shop. Uh, I also want to touch base. Ezzy Spencer, the author of Lunar Abundance, is doing a live new moon intention setting ceremony with us in our book club Facebook group next week. So I want to touch base with her and just kind of get our ducks in a row for that. And then I also want to continue working on the new planners that are going to be in my shop. I'm planning on having a academic year and teacher planner in the shop on June 1st, so I need to get those finished. And then also working on my 2019 planners. All right, and that is basically going to be my day today. You'll notice I've kept my entire task list basically computer related so that I can still kind of nurse myself on the couch today. Um, let's see, up next we want to fill in our monthly spread. So I'm gonna go to my May tab and fill in my habit tracker. All right, so for yesterday, I did not ride. I did not do strength training. I did take my prenatal. I did eat clean. And I did go to bed by 11. 
And then this morning I did wake up by six. And I have not rode my Peloton today for obvious reasons, but if I get to feeling better later, I'm definitely gonna hop on. Um, I did take my prenatal vitamin already this morning, so I'm gonna go ahead and color that in. Okay, so we've got that there. And then up next is my gratitude log. So I'm gonna grab my gray pen. And my gratitude for yesterday is gonna be a heating pad because it basically saved my life yesterday. <laughs> All right, there we go. My heating pad is in there. And then finally is my mood mandala. So although it was kind of stressful yesterday not being able to get everything done that I wanted to, and I was definitely kind of tired and definitely also kind of feeling uh, but overall my day yesterday was pretty relaxed. I'm trying to do a lot better at learning to take care of myself, which I'm not always admittedly the best at. In the past, I would have absolutely just barreled through all of my tasks and probably been worse off because of it. But instead, I listened to myself and I took care of myself. And it was a pretty relaxing day. The important things still got done and I was way less stressed about it than I would have been in the past. So I'm actually gonna go with relaxed for my mood yesterday. So I'm grabbing my pink here. There we go. And I think I'm gonna continue drawing my mandala a little bit. I have three extra rings here to fill in. So I'm gonna go into Procreate and go to my mandala. And let's turn all those background layers back on. There we go. So I have three more rings to fill in. I think I'm gonna draw a circle around this. All right, and let's see, what do I want to add to these three rings? All right, I think since this is turning out to be pretty floral, I think I'm going to add another petal, maybe here. And now that I think about it, I wanted to do that in a separate layer so that I can rotate it. So I'm going to add a layer above here, and let's do that again. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's... <laughs> That's as good as it's getting. All right, so now with this layer, it's just that little petal. I'm gonna swipe down with three fingers on the screen and I'm gonna hit copy and paste. And then down on the very bottom, I'm gonna hit this rotate button. And then I'm gonna make sure I'm on free form down there as well and just pop that into place. And then I'll repeat that all the way around. All right, there we go. And then I think I'll come in and add just a little something to these petals here. And I'm gonna make sure that all these layers are merged. So I'm just gonna tap the top one with one finger and the bottom with another and then just pinch them together. All right, now I can turn off all of my background and I'm gonna try something new today. I'm going to use the lasso tool, which is this kind of S shape up here, and I'm just going to lasso all around it. And I'm going to swipe down with three fingers and hit copy. And now I'm going to go back into my planner, and I want to make sure the read only tool is selected. It's this pencil with a slash through it in the top. And I'm going to tap and hold on my mandala and delete that. There we go. And now I'm going to tap and hold and paste. And now I have that mandala brought in from Procreate. Now I just need to crop and resize it. And there we go. That looks pretty good. All right, so mood mandala is done. Now I can get back to my current week. Just double check everything. Everything looks good and I am good to go. All right, y'all, I'm gonna run off and tackle my day. I have a lot of goodies in store for you in the next couple of days, so definitely stay tuned for that and I will look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>